The following program contains flash photography. Viewer's discretion is advised. Saturday, 7th of April 2018, marked the beginning of a new chapter for Adirunke and Olawale as they were joined together according to the customs and tradition of the Yorubas, one of the major ethnic groups in Nigeria. Call it a dream come true for these two impeccable lovebirds as this was evidently shown with natural excitement on their faces. Even well wishes were also partakers of their countless joy. Ronke, a finance department staff of TVC Communications, looked all regal and stunning in a royal blue attire that matched the attire of a other hour. The groom, Olawale, stunned the venue in this colorful fashion. <laughs> The visibly elated, beautiful bride, Ronke, and the maids of honor made their presence felt in this mind blowing fashion. Grand moment, Ronke and Olawale officially became one. It's your wedding day. So be happy and rejoice Whatever they say Today you made your choice This is only where one and one is With the traditional marital rites performed Attention was shifted to the eagerly awaited reception This time, the newlywed in another impressive outlook triggered another round of excitement at the beautifully decorated hall. Moment to serve up for Ronke and Olawale. Three! I said it three! In summary, they both agreed, you know, which that's what marriage is all about. Yeah, I don't know if I'm in the right way to say that because I'm just a few months old, but it's all about compromise, it's all about cooperation, it's all about communication, just the way he communicated with his wife. So I wish you both. You know, everything you, you wish yourself in this life. Understand the level. This old guy is not tired though. He wants to do. 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 He wants to do
you die. Romanto. Oh, my love This exclusive chat with events diary, Bronke and Olawale share their love story. Uh, I feel great because I never believed something like this can happen this year. But thank God it's happening now. How do you feel, wife? I feel great. I feel wonderful. I feel fulfilled <laughs> because it's not really easy. <laughs> like they say, anybody must go to the village. Yeah. Um, it all started, uh, say, two years ago. And um, I had a broken relationship, so I was like, um, the next one that is coming is going to, um, uh, the person going to suffer. So I'm like, okay. <laughs> so when he came around, I was like, hey, poor guy, innocent guy. I said, okay, let me play along. And it's just like, and I'm like, oh, I'm loving this guy, I'm loving this guy. And he was just ready, he knows what he wants. And he was like, hey, baby, I want to marry you. And I'm like, ah, it's too fast, okay, let's take it cool. He said, no, he doesn't want to wait and all that. To cut the long story short, here I am. I'm married. When I first met her, I never knew I'm going to get married to her because my mind was just like, fine, I'm a play guy. <laughs> I don't, when it comes to woman, I'm not that, I don't like getting serious and I don't like getting closer. But when I met her, I felt, this is the wife. So that was Genesis, and that was when I concluded that, oh, I have a beautiful girlfriend. This can be the mother of my child. I'm going to spend the rest of my life with you, and that gives me so much joy. I love you with every beat of my heart. Thank you for taking me off the sprint I would and making me a married woman. <laughs> this is the love of my life. Without uh -huh. I don't think I'm going to get to where I am today like because when I met her that was when I decided like when she talks to me I listen to her and I believe she has a lot to play in my life I love you I love you okay. my wife as it is synonymous with the staff of TVC communications in this show of support for Ronke they dazzle their way on the dance floor Let's listen to family and other well wishes. Uh, the advice I will give to them is just that when you are husband and wife, it's different from family. When you when you have an issue with your wife or your husband, it's better you call him and salute it within yourself rather than you reporting the person to the wife, the, husband, the family and all those stuff. With that, I believe their marriage is going to be a long lasting one. Our advice are to be respectful, to be loyal to our in-laws, to be always loyal, to, she should be honest and she should be always do her role as a woman and as a mother. Live your life and keep your thing to yourself. Don't let people advise you, don't let already or 
don't let uh, my friend say, oh, I saw your husband in another car with another woman. It could be anybody. So whatever happened outside, let it be outside. Keep your home together. That's it. The way the two of them come together, and I thank God the two of them, they are learned. They can take care of their family in a good way. And one thing is that when the two couples going up, the two family back there up. If they're this, I call them, don't report yourself to anybody. Sort out your problem in your home. Don't report yourself to me and don't report it to the other family. From that, the two of them will come together. At the end of the day, they have a good home. No, do call it. Can I did this? Is, no, 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 no. Wait, this is, my dear, you do what I don't like. It's all right. The two of them come together. That's why the two of them made one room. The two of them will join together to become one. That's why we call it happy home. And I pray for them. They will have a happy home in Jesus' name. From us here at Event Diary, we are wishing the couple a blissful marriage. Hi. 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 Hi.